people often say there are two things you never want to see being made, laws and sausages. And I know you've seen sausages made. So what can you tell us about the process? Is it really unseemly? Well, I've heard a lot about laws, but I can tell you, you know, as I've looked into plants, the plants are really a lot of fun to watch. In fact, I think most people would say this is a lot like making a chocolate chip cookie. In a lot of ways, it's the same process where as they look at it, they gather the ingredients, they blend them and mix them, and then they produce a, a hot dog or a sausage product on the other end through the system. So what kind of cuts of meat are used? So yeah, just like in a chocolate chip cookie, when they gather the ingredients, they take a look at the different ingredients that they might use for, for meat products. So they'd use the same type of beef or pork or poultry products that you might see in a grocery store. And they'll take those pieces and they'll grind those uh, and chop those. And then they will mix them with ingredients like salt and sugar and, and cured ingredients. And then they will blend those together and come up with a final hot dog. Consumers have also heard that we use everything but the oink in making sausages. Are organ meats used in hot dogs and sausages? In reality, the majority of hot dogs are made without any type of organ or variety meats at all. And if it is there, it's on the label. It's labeled as a byproduct, made with byproducts, and the specific byproduct that's used is listed in the ingredients as well. And so a consumer can very quickly look at a label and determine what was put in that product. Uh, and if it says beef, pork, or poultry, then it's made from the same cuts that you might see for steaks or roasts. So just the trimmings from those cuts as they produce those. And so it's a just pure beef, pork, poultry product. So are they inspected? Yeah, all plants are inspected from the time the product comes in from a raw material standpoint to the time it's finally cooked and put in the package. There are inspectors that come from the Food Safety and Inspection Service of USDA, and they're in that plant observing the hygiene and the sanitation of those plants and also looking at the raw ingredients and the finished ingredients and doing testing on those to make sure that that product is safe and wholesome. And in addition to that, they also approve everything that's on the label. So every ingredient that was ever, ever put in a sausage product has already gone through and been approved by FSIS, USDA. And at the same time, they have approved the listing of the ingredients, the weights, and all the other aspects that go along with processing that, that product. Well, this is very different from what you might read on the internet. So what's your bottom line message for consumers about eating hot dogs and sausages? Well, bottom line is it really is a very neat process, a very very clean process as well. Stainless steel from, from you know, top to bottom. And the product is labeled and inspected throughout the entire process. And so it is a very safe, wholesome product for the consumer. And do you feed them to your family? Oh, yes, all the time. Well, thanks so much, Dr. Hale. Thank you.